With almost 500 sessions at Next 2018, it's understandable that you couldn't get to them all. So if you didn't see Get Productive with Gmail add-ons, then stay tuned because here's the rewind. I'm Joanna Smith and I picked this rewind because my number one focus this year is replacing tedious tasks with clever solutions, and add-ons can be exceedingly clever. Akash Sani, a product manager on Google Cloud, takes the stage to remind us of what we already know. Gmail is a powerhouse of productivity. No joke, Google runs on email internally. So the problem is that context switching hurts productivity, and we often find ourselves switching between apps and tabs to move information in and out of our email. Gmail add-ons put a stop to all the switching, because add-ons bring actions inside of the Gmail app, both web and mobile. Akash does a great job of explaining how add-ons can affect you no matter your perspective. He goes over users, enterprise and security needs, and even developer details. So let's go through that. First, users. It turns out that users love add-ons. There were over 4 million installs in the first nine months, and more than 80% of all current add-ons have four-star ratings or higher. Side note for developers here, they're fairly easy to create because a developer only needs to write one add-on and it creates a consistent experience for Gmail, both on the web and on mobile. Users are delighted. Okay, so now let's talk enterprise. We know that there are special considerations for our enterprise users, so we designed add-ons from the beginning with this in mind. We actually built security and management tools directly in. Add-ons have limited access scopes. Add-ons are managed by the G Suite admin console for domain-wide installs or whitelists of approved add-ons. Add-ons are built on AppScript, making them a perfect fit for internal tools and solutions you might need, which can then be published internally. Okay, so over the past year, the development team has doubled down on add-ons as the platform for extending Gmail, and currently, they've already proven to be useful when reading your email. But writing email is just as important. Think about it. You don't really want to open a tab, find the right thing, copy that link, go back to Gmail, and then paste it into your draft. But honestly, how many times have you already done that today? So they are introducing Compose Actions for Gmail add-ons, which allows a user to invoke an add-on from the Compose view. No more app and tab switching. It doesn't matter if you're a user or developer, you're probably just as excited as I am right now, right? Okay, so at this point, Akash steps aside so that we can hear directly from other companies that already built Gmail add-ons. They discuss their process and what they created, and I won't go over those because I've got more rewinds to make, but it's definitely worth checking out. If you'd like to see the full talk, check out the link in the description below. And don't forget to subscribe to the Cloud YouTube channel for more great Next Rewind content. Thanks for watching.